let's today know about the uh, network switching techniques what all what is a switching technique switching technique help us in designing the best route of if there are multiple paths it helps us to choose the best route out of the multiple routes in order to send the message from sender to the receiver in a best way so there the passing of the data from one computer to another which are interconnected this helps us to pass the information from one computer to another computer which are interconnected with each other so there are different uh, types of uh, switching techniques that is number 1 circuit switching the second is message switching the third one is packet switching techniques in circuit switching techniques dedicated path that is established between the sender and the receiver for example telephone in circuit switching technique a dedicated path a physical type of physical path is established between the sender and the receiver in order to receive and send the required message from one party to another from one place to another so we can understand it by an example in olden days we have uh this type of technique that is called telephone so in telephone with the help of telephone we are able to send message from one place to another place that means a path is that a dedicated path is established first the second type of this network switching technique is the message switching what is the message switching message switching is also a process of uh, transfer of message from one person to an another or communication to communicate from sender to receiver this information is sent from one place to another in the form of units or hope and this message is first stored when there is a bundle of message when there is more message to send from one place to another this message is stored in the storage device then from the storage device it is sent to the receiver so this is the second type of this switching technique that is message switching the third one is packet switching in packet switching the message is sent in packets so this message when a person wants to send the message to the receiver this message does not uh, the person cannot send this message at once but it can be sent in packets so the receiver has to receive the message in packets in units and this message after sending this message by units to units the receiver receives an acknowledgement in which there is the sequence of the message the receiver can uh, choose and know about the full message of the sender with the help of this acknowledgement the acknowledgement is the sequence of the messages so the receiver is able to uh, see or know about the full message of the sender 
So this was about the switching techniques, network switching techniques. So there are three types of network switching techniques. The first one is circuit switching technique. The second one is message switching technique. The third one is packet switching technique. Packet switching technique or message switching technique is a connectionless uh, technique for the communication. So the rest will be discussed in the next uh, thing.